all right guys so uh we got some interesting news from anime adventures but before we hop into it we are doing a 1 million robux giveaway i got all the robux ready to go all you guys have to enter is hit the subscribe button and drop a like on the video the goal is to get to 1 million subscribers all right and we're very very close so what uh, today we're gonna be going over the new news basically confirming what's up with anime adventures and i have some great news guys the title is not clickbait. It is ready to be re-released. So uh, this is some info from one of the technical owners of the game and one of the main developers. So uh, let's go hop on in. As you guys can see, we're in the group own that owns the game, Gomu. All right. And we're over here into the equal section. So this guy right here is a, one of the developers. Now, they did rename everything for legal reasons. Um, and as you can see here, guys, his name is Blaze. All right, so Blaze is one of the developers of the game, or at least one of the staff members, and he actually posted this. So uh, this is actually wild. So let's get into it. All right, so here's his first message, guys. He says, I was the only other owner, guys, on AA. So this guy is one of the owners. He owns Percentage um, besides Scripps and Stray. So he's one of the three owners, and I've been working on the game since release. All right, so he has basically been working on the game pretty much the entire time. I guess he might even be friends with Scripps and Stray. However, he is one of the owners of AA. All right, here's his other message, guys. He says, uh, we resolved all of the DMCA content, guys, like a day or two after the game went down. So what this means, guys, is the game is ready to be released. All of the DMCA issues have been resolved. So uh, they could drop the game, I guess, technically at any time. All right. And then he also posted this as well. All right, let me get the screenshot. Um, uh, the game not being up right now is Scripps and Stray's choice. It has nothing to do with Game Fam. So uh, basically, if Scripps and Stray's decide to release the game, they totally could. The game is 100% ready to go. All right. And then he has um, uh, this message right here. Uh, the de they got spooked because Rail Bros made a tweet about how official brand partners were coming on to Roblox and they didn't want to risk any future co right, copyright issues because remember guys, they could get sued and lose all money plus legal fees. All right. They could potentially lose millions of dollars, guys. Uh, depending on how the companies decide, actually, honestly, if the companies, if it was worth it for the companies to sue them, they could lose all of the money and potentially more and pay a ton of fees. So according to this guys, the AA developers took down the game themselves. So, right. So basically blaze says that scripts and stray took the game down themselves. And that it, as you can see in the last screenshot, it has nothing to do with game fam so uh basically the owners of the game took the game down themselves nothing to do with game fam all right and um uh it looks like the owners have been ghosting um uh, the other developers for months so they're uh they're in hawaii right now guys with their millions um <laughs> so uh that is the story with anime adventures guys the game is ready to drop um i guess all that has to happen is for the developers to decide to drop it now honestly seeing how popular anime defenders is i'm surprised they didn't completely just redo all of the units and re-release the game but i kind of get it they're trying to not get sued for what they did in the past so uh, i guess they technically could still get sued for what they did in the past but it's a little bit more legally complicated so that's the story with anime adventures and don't forget guys to smash the subscribe button if you guys want to be entered into win 1 million robux once we hit 1 million subs catch you guys in the next one peace